is going on guys divine nade gaming here and as you can see right there dark matter grind 18 out of 33 guns gold that, that's pretty cool also we got the wrench I got the other night gold yesterday I was gonna make a video yesterday but I had my uh, best friends quinceanera or whatever people want to call it 78 out of 300 um yes I was I did a lot of grinding the other night. Today I'll be talking about how to get, well, gold. First, you need, usually you need your 100 headshots. Currently I'm working on the Elkar 9. Um, usually I'd play hardcore free for all, because if it's not a one shot kill, well your team will kill them. If you don't feel comfortable playing free for all, by all means play any of these other guy modes, except search and destroy. Search and destroy, you only get like, on a good game, I get like seven kills a game. So, but currently, I'm probably going to play Mercenary Mosh Pit or Knock 3 Town, because, you know, that's not an E. It's not an E, Treyarch. It's Nuke Town with an E. Because since we're most likely based on the year 3000, you could have just said Nuke Town 3000 like you did in Black Ops 2 with Nuke Town 2025. So, <clears throat> Pretty much just what you want to do. Max out your gun so you have high caliber and ELO. ELO is probably the best sight. I don't really like Red Dot. I love ELO. Hey, does anybody else see that second prestige glitch when I go through the sights? Weapon level max, second prestige. Weapon level max, first prestige. Weapon level max, no prestige. <laughs> it's just funny. Um, you don't... You can use any attachments. Uh... Long barrel is an option. Any of these are really options. Just, I wouldn't use quick draw or suppressor or laser sight because you're not hip firing. Like, don't use suppressor because it takes away your range and a little bit of damage. In my opinion. So, it, it's just not worth it. And quick draw, you don't really need that. You can if you want to. I wouldn't recommend it. So, it's just pretty much what you want to do is play all the guns the L car 9 is not great for hardcore it's not I just played the game with it I did horrible let's just look at that game yeah highest level in the game people think that means everything and levels don't mean anything they just, it just means you can get um, kills you can get kills over a matter of time but I'm decent I'd say my KD's gone down point two since I last checked it that might be because I was using the wrench I've been playing for uh, what do you call it three days as you can see right there three thirty three minutes and forty six seconds and I'm already and I can be prestige five within the hour so really what I recommend is hardcore free for all or TDM not round based game modes they're decent in size. Um, they're 10 minutes long if you don't get to the full score, which free for all you usually do. Team deathmatch almost every time. Core, if you're not really into free for all, it's harder, but it's not impossible. So um, I'm not going to play a game because that would take too long. I'm also going to talk to you guys about specialists and hero gear. So you need to get all of these all the 800 kills and all the kills with your specialist ability or weapon currently I have the Bruin the Reaper the Specter and the Fire Break done that's four out of nine still need these people one two three four five so we're working on the Sparrow <laughs> hardcore definitely because if you get it near them, well, they're dead. Because it's about, it's about either 50% health or lower. I'm not 100% sure. Oh, I didn't even notice I had all these outfits for her. But I prefer Earth. Do I have any black mark? No, of course not. Vision pulse, I have no idea. I'm not great. Use FMJ, shoot people through walls. <laughs> that's, that's just what comes straight to mind. Tempest never used it. I've never used the Tempest once. Glitch is 
kind of weird. It, it's a weird one. Like, if someone catches you from behind. Oh, hey, got that. Um, if someone catches you from behind, well, glitch right back to where you were at, kill the dude. It, it's really weird. So, um, battery, war machine, straightforward. Play, play, um, objective based. Why, right when you, if you have your war machine ready, uh, see someone capturing it, and you see more than a person, I recommend it. Fire one shot into there, and you'll most likely hit everyone. Kill everyone. Annihilator, well, run and gun, obviously. Combat focus, low kill streaks, low score streaks. So I'm not just talking any score streaks. I'm calling, saying HCXD UAV care package. Or whatever, like, low combination you want. Like, don't go over a thousand, I'd say. So, like, I'd say, like, I wouldn't even say go up to 950, because that's, that's 10 kills in a row if you don't have if you didn't get like any assists or anything like that I'd say just counter UAV would be the max cause you're getting you're getting like double so I'm just pretty much this is like a tutorial on what would you do Nomad Hive learn not to die after you shoot your hives and reject I don't know melee weapon as soon as you get up just slap the dude that killed you cause they'll usually watch you I know I did and these guys, do I need to explain this one? I doubt I do. Psychosis, don't even act like one of your bots. I don't, I did, it took me so long. I'm very angry that it took me too long. But yeah. Um, Spectre. Since he's totally melee, uh, let me go back to Sparrow. I didn't mean to click X. Um, Spectre. Use melee weapons. That's all I can say is because you'll already be close up and personal if you have your melee weapon, so you can use your ripper. If you're trying to get your melee weapon gold, well, you're going to have to take a few kills out of it. Uh, active camo. Definitely use melee weapons so you know you're hitting your target. This one went by fast. Like, you don't. Active camos was really easy for me. Purifier. It has decent range, but not halfway across Nuck 3 Town. Yes, I'm going to keep saying that. Heat Wave, use a submachine gun. <laughs> Seriously, save yourself the time. I used a melee weapon. That was my mistake. Um, it took me all night, the night I posted the um, supply drop opening video, just to get one. No, wait, that was in the middle of the day before I even, yesterday before I uh, went to the party. Um, just save yourself time and use a submachine gun. Find two people, blow up, like, I was playing Hunted when I used my submachine gun. I played one game with a submachine gun and got it immediately. That was easy. Purifier, try to play Nuketown. Yes, I, I'm tired of saying that Nuck Free Town is just really boring to say, and, well, yeah, that's mainly all the characters. Oh, kinetic armor, light it up, submachine gun or assault rifle, whatever you feel comfortable with, and just shoot people. I'd recommend getting all the 800 kills with people before using their specialist, because then you can just have all those. Um, hope you, hope this helped you, uh, gave you some tips if you're looking for it. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.